Hey guys, how's everybody doing? Hope everybody's doing well. You know me, I'm Tom. Man, what a beautiful day in the neighborhood. It's Tuesday afternoon. I just came off of two hard days of landscaping, made a bunch of new customers, and made a bunch of money. And I'm telling you what, now I'm chilling back at the Hacienda, and I just wanted to show you what I'm doing. Everything is looking good, man. The grass is beautiful. My annuals are coming up. Look at that. Look how beautiful that is. Oh yeah, the hollies. I mean, the lawn is just looking fabulous. The Japanese maple. Man, it's beautiful. Look at this grass. And of course, being that I'm having such a successful two days here, and I signed another big contract today too, big rot job, over $7,000 worth of work. So I decided to do a little celebration, and I'm cooking. Almost 300 degrees. The teriyaki. Are you ready? Are you hungry? Okay, here we go. Oh man, look at that. Now that was on sale today at Walmart, a big old uh, pork butt. And I just cut it in half, I got that for $6. It's like three and a half pounds of meat, it's insane. Oh, I know that makes you hungry. Salt, pepper, and teriyaki sauce. Man, that is beautiful. All right, let's go see what's in the kitchen here. Come on in the house. Got my little cutting table here. Of course, the ice house. And everybody asks me, is Ice House sponsoring me? And maybe one day they will, but I'm not making any money. This just happens to be my favorite beer. Okay, let's go check out what's underneath these pots. Mmm. Rice. Looking good. And spinach. The, what they call long cut or whole. Nice. Beautiful. Hacienda's looking good. Of course, I always have my 45 waiting. Never know. But the house looks great. Everything's chilled out. My little reading area. Now I bought this. Let me let me say something about this. This is a thousand dollar Italian leather handcrafted chair and ottoman. And I went to an estate sale, and I mean it's some high high end leather, and I bought it for one hundred and forty bucks. My little chill out zone right here. My blue whales, of course my. Uh, Japanese uh, friends and happiness, my candles, my artwork, which I've got a lot of artwork everywhere. I've got artwork everywhere. But oh yeah, nice. Mm, can't wait for the everything to start boiling here, but. All right. Nice. What a beautiful day. What a beautiful day. Yard is looking excellent. Absolutely excellent. Hey guys, how's everybody doing? Hope everybody is doing well. First off, thank you guys very much 
we're chiming in on video 500 with me and Patty up on the farm and that was totally ad lib. I had a buzz, I was drinking some beer, Patty came up, we started cooking some beer brats and just enjoyed ourselves. You know, Patty and I have gone, you know, we go a long ways back. We tried dating and we found out we were better friends than we were, hold on, life in the city, a lot of noise on the interstate. But we found out that we were better friends than we were uh, uh, in a relationship. And, and rightfully so. So we didn't want to ruin it by, uh, you know, just saying, oh, you know, we quit. So we didn't quit. We just hung around each other, come to find out. We just, we feed, we feed off of each other a lot, you know. Uh, she, she's real simple. Uh, she's complex. She's very intelligent. She's got a great job. And I'm, I'm, I'm kind of like the wild card, you know. I'm crazy. I'm wild. I'm weird. You know, I like dark humor, and uh, her and I, that salt and pepper, you know, the opposites attract thing, we ended up finding out that we're really good friends, and we like to laugh a lot and have fun, and even though I, I <laughs> you know, I push all her buttons all the time, and, 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 and she knows I do it, I don't mean to, but, you know, it just, just kind of comes out that way, which is all cool, and she laughs, and sometimes she looks at me, kind of gives me the weird look, you know, and, and that's pretty cool. But I want to just say, guys, thank you very much uh, for viewing my channel. And, you know, what can, I, what can I say? All the people that have chimed in on my channel and, and just left some really positive comments and the ones that leave negative comments, you know what? It's all good, man. Uh, I, don't, I don't mean to come off like I'm some, you know, badass guy. But the thing is, is that, you know, you only got one life to live. So you might as well enjoy it, you know. Sometimes you have to push the boundaries of what your personality uh, can do. And, and like today, I was in a neighborhood. Guy approached me. He goes, hey, Tom, you know, uh, let me show you this problem I got at my house. And it's uh, something we talked about several times. I know the guy. And he went ahead and gave me a $3,000 deposit today and just said, I just want you to fix my house. I've seen the work you do. I mean, I know what you're capable of. And, and I know that you like to work by yourself and you don't like, to, you know, you don't, you don't hire anybody. And, and I just want you to take your time and just do the work. You know, if it takes you a couple of months, it takes you a couple of months. And I told him, I said, look, man, I'm busy as hell. And I says, I don't mind doing this work. I said, but I just want to let you know that, you know, don't put me on a time schedule, okay? Just don't put me on a time schedule. I was in another neighborhood Monday doing my landscaping because I had a couple special requests. And... I had neighbors, people coming up to me all day Monday just saying, Tom, God, please, uh, how do you get your, you know, these properties looking so good? You know, the HOA, uh, they're not doing us any justice, and uh, we just want our yard to look right. You know, we'd rather pay extra, even though we're paying HOA dues, and just go ahead and get the yard right, you know. And so all day Monday, God, I did four yards, all new customers, you know, just hitting them, uh, up for you know just one big service you know it was like hundred and fifty dollars each yard and I sat back and and did each each one of them and then you know one of them turned into a year-round contract which was cool too so uh, all I can say is that if you do quality work the bottom line is is that people will come to you man they will just come to you and, 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 and all, all it boils down to is the results. You know, what they see is what they want. You know, they, they want to see, they want their yard, their property to look exactly the same way. They just want it to look good. You know, and they don't mind paying. You know, and that's the thing. I keep telling myself all the time, I said, Tom, you know, don't get discouraged. You know, just keep doing it the way you've always been doing it. Do quality work. And, and people will come to you. And, and man, it's so true. Guys, if you get in the handyman business, you're in any kind of small business, you know, keep remembering that. You know, don't shortcut nothing. Just s stay on the quality track. And if you do that, I swear, they will come back to you time and time again. They'll keep giving you work. I'm so booked right now that, you know, in reality, I, I, I you know, for the next couple, three months, you know, I'm... Booked 
six days a week. If I, if I want it to be that way, that's the way it is. So I just want to let you guys know, uh, you know, I do appreciate a lot of your comments and, and that you guys are all interested in the handyman business, and I want you to be because it's exploding here in Raleigh. It's just, it never stops. It seems like when I have a couple days off, I'm wondering, oh, God, where am I going to get my next job? And then I get out on the streets, and all of a sudden, bam, it's like, ha. Huh. You know, I get broadsided by all these requests to do work for people. And, and yesterday was no exception. Okay, guys, I just wanted to leave you with this uh, video. This is 501 with a cooking video. And, man, I'm telling you what, I am starving. I'm ready to eat. Let's look at it again. Oh, man. Yeah, that's beautiful. Let's turn them over. Oh, look at the look at the look at the grill stripes in that. Oh, that's gonna be some good eating right there, folks. I wish I wish you were here eating with me. I'd share. All right, let's go check the rice. Looking good. Spinach, finally boiling. Perfect. All right, there we go. All right, boys and girls. Thank you very much for viewing my channel. And, uh, you know, sometimes, sometimes I can be a little rude, you know, and rough. And I cuss a little bit and I drink beer. And I don't mean to, you know, push anybody's buttons. Uh, I just don't. But, you know, I, I love living life, and, and, I'll, and I live life to the fullest. I really do. I try my best every single day because I'm in the right town, the right situation. I've got the right business, and, 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 it's, and it's all coming my way. And, and, and I'm, just riding, I'm just riding the wave, man. I'm hanging 10. You know what I'm saying? So I just wish you were all hanging 10 with me, brothers and sisters. Y'all know what to do. Hit the subscribe button if you're not a subscriber. And if you are, leave those buttons alone. Give me those thumbs up. Leave those comments. And I'll check you guys out on another video. Tom, out of here. Hasta la vista, baby. Bye. On this beautiful, beautiful Tuesday afternoon at the Hacienda.